Hello everybody, I am Alex S. Warrior. Welcome back to Pokemon Gold. Last time, we had a quite a cool trek through the ice cave. <laughs> Please don't undescribe it. I was promising it, but it'll get better. And today, we are going to be challenging the Blackthorn City Gym Leader. Now, I already did a bit of level grinding to make sure the team is up to snuff to fight whomever is in here. I'm going to be a dragon user like Claire. Yep, the leader of this gym is a dragon type gym leader. So, of course, I had to train up Pika Blue. And since Pika Blue knows Ice Punch, it should be. Okay, it's not gonna be easy, of course, but it'll be manageable. Welcome to the gym. What does this person have to say? Your first battle against dragons? I'll show you how tough they are. And Dratini. This is... Well, of course it's a dragon Pokemon. But this is the first version of Dragonite. Goes from this, to Dragonair, to Dragonite. And since it is unevolved, it's Ice Punch fodder. And would you look at that? Another Dratini. All the, all the right for us to just lay the icy smack down. Adios. Oh, what? Dragon Rage. That's gonna do exactly 40 HP. Dragon Rage is a move that does fixed damage. It'll always take away 40 HP. So, it's basically Sonic Boom, but twice as good. And lastly, what a shock, another Jatini. Jeez, Paul, if you're such a cool trainer, how about you just train, you know, more than just the same Pokemon three times? Or you could evolve them. That's another thing you can do. And that's that's Paul taken care of. I'm disappointed. Oh really? You honestly thought three Dratinis? would be enough to take down someone who's already taken like seven gym badges. Oh yeah, I forgot this gym was a this gym is a strength puzzle as well. As if we didn't already, you know, have enough of those. What do you have to say? We go through right rigorous training under Claire. I can't afford to lose. We afford 5 bucks and 32 cents. And... Seedra! Now, this isn't Dragon-type Pokémon, but the Pokédex does classify it as a Dragon Pokémon. For some reason. And this is why I trained up Charger. Because Seedra... It evolves into a, di a new Dragon-type Pokémon that debuted in this generation called Kingdra. Kingdra is a Water and Dragon-type, meaning its only weakness is Dragon. Kinda of gonna be a problem, but we can take care of that. I have a plan. And that takes care of the Seedra. You know, I've always wanted to train the freaking Kingdra line. All three of the designs are really cool. I especially like Seedra. Let's see. I'm trying to figure out. Am I supposed to push those? Oh, wait a minute. Hmm. The puzzle pieces are all coming together. It's not as if we all use dragon type Pokemon. My policy uses Pokemon that are stronger than dragon. Oh! Are we going to see an ice type trainer in this dragon type gym? Well, it's cool trainer Cody. No. STRONGER THAN A DRAGON <laughs> Yes, because when I think stronger than a dragon Pokémon, I too think of Horsey. Okay, that's gonna be a bit problematic.
Well, bye, horsey. And look at that, Cedra. Eh, Lorax could use a couple levels. Let's let's keep him out here. Oh, freaking the smoke screen's catching up to me. Oh no! No! Yeah. Okay, that's better. And that takes care of the Cedra. Whoa, that's a lot of experience. You are special. Thank you! And we're gonna use these to solve a strength puzzle. It's like the one of the ice path, except shorter. Thank god. I don't know why I wasn't able to move. Hmm. Oh, yes. Yes. The puzzle pieces are once again lining up. Whoosh! Whoosh! Alright, let's see where that took us. Oh! Oh wow, we can fight Claire right now, after fighting these two people. Don't mind if I do. My chance of losing? Not even 1%. You're right. It's 100%. Ayo! <laughs> Old Trainer Mike. And... Okay, this is a Dragonair. This is the evolved form of Dratini. And honestly, I love this thing's design. If this were... Oh. Can't just... Can't just paralyze me the moment I say something nice about you. That's just rude. That's even ruder. That's very rude. Anyway, I really like this thing's design. If this was a standalone Pokemon, I wouldn't be complaining. Not that Dragonite's not cool. Dragonite's awesome. But I love this thing's design. And as long as we don't uh, keep paralysis here, we should be able to take out... Yes! Now I know I have a lot of healing stuff in my bag, so this paralysis should be nothing. And... Double Edge. That's uh, not worth it. I want to keep my three Water Eight Gems and Ice Punch. Double Edge is a move like Takedown, except it's much more powerful. That's odd. Yeah, it's very odd. Anyway, let's heal up our... I think I have a full story. Do I have a full story in here somewhere? No, I do not. Let's uh, make the most of it. Away. And... Full heal. Oh wait, you're the one that needs full healing! What am I doing? And you. Dragons are sacred Pokémon! They're full of life energy! If you're not serious, you won't be able to beat them! Joke's on you, I'm never serious and look how far I've come! <laughs> wait, that's not true at all. Wool Trainer Lola. You're gonna talk to me about not being serious when you're packing a Dratini. In the last gym of the game. Once again, it lives on what has to be 1 HP. Oh, mother- not again! You know, just for that, I'm gonna friggin' disrespect you and your- and your Dratini. Use Whirlpool on it. Hatred. <laughs> and that's uh, the next Pokemon gonna be. 
Dragonair. Hmm, I'm gonna try my luck with Ice Punch and then heal up. I know for a fact we're not gonna die to the to Dragon Rage. Alright. And heal. Uh, oh right. We need more health! And Dragon Rage again. I'm gonna try my luck at another Ice Punch before I uh, cure my paralysis. I just wish uh, friggin' Aqua Jet existed in this gen. And there goes Dragonair. Way to go! Thank you! You're very nice. Anyway, this is Claire. Now, I'm not 100% sure, but I think she leads with Gyarados. Either that or I'm thinking of Lance. Oh wait, now I remember. She has three Dragonair and a Kingdra, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep uh I'm gonna keep Pika Blue up front and use a full restore. No, full full heal. You know what, we're gonna save right in front of her just in things just in case things don't go quite the way I want them to. I am Claire, the world's best Dragon Master. That is a lie. I can hold my own even against the Pokemon League's Elite Four. Do you still want to take me on? Fine, let's do it. As a trainer, I'll use my full power against any opponent. And this is it, the final gym leader. Dragon-type user, Claire. And her Dragonair. And Pika Blue. Air. Pika Blair. Oh, f already. All right. How much is this gonna do? Ah, uh, jeez. Oh, wow. That is awesome. Oh. Oh, Dragon Breath. That's a special Dragon-type move. That apparently doesn't do 40 HP. <laughs> and next up... What a shock, it's Dragonair. Each one has a different, weird move. I think one has, like, Blizzard, one has Thunderbolt. Oh! Oh no, this is the one that had Thunderbolt. No! This is fine. This is not fine. <laughs> Sorry, Pika Blue. You deserved better. Hmm. Let's see if I can confuse it. I know it has... I know it has the freaking Thunderbolt. But we're faster, we're Crobat. And... Come on. Darn it! Oh! Yes! Beautiful! That... Hmm... That don't seem right. Oh wow, went down just like that. Okay, another Dragonair. I'm not sure which one this is. Let's just brute force it. 
Let's have our cow come out and do some brute forcing. Maybe some flinching. Yeah, it was worth a try. Okay, this is the one that has Ice Beam. And I know one of them had a fire move. I think. I'll have it on screen if I'm wrong. And last up is her Kingdra. This Pokemon is annoying. All because of one move, and the fact that it's only weak to dragons. And that, my friends, is Smokescreen. We all know what Smokescreen does. But you know what we're gonna do? Something we can't do in the remakes, because it's holding a freaking Citrus Berry. Oh. It's a good thing they did- it's a good thing Kingdra did this after I already poisoned it. <laughs> I am very clever. Get a razor leaf off. Oh, oh right. Excruciating pain! We'll keep mashing razor leaf until we, we hit it. Even if freaking we get smoke screened six times. It's gonna hit one of these days. It's going to hit in this battle. It's going to hit. I know it will. I will keep mashing the A button until I see Razor Leaf hit that Kingdra. Oh, go! Oh, wow. Oh, wait, it has to recharge. Hmm. Let's see if I can find any of those guard- like, something that gets rid of all those stat changes. Okay, I don't have anything like that. Let's try it anyway. Darn it. At this point, the, <laughs> the only thing I've done so far is that actually has hurt the Kingdra is the poison powder. I should open my big fat mouth more often. Oh god, that was a crit. I think at this point we're gonna let the... It missed with Hyper Beam? Now that's poetic justice. At this point, we're gonna... If Lorax gets taken out, we're gonna send in Crobat to use Confusion. Ow, my face! Or dare you throw a laser at me? The sheer indescribable pain! And hurt by poison. I'm not sure if it's if they're gonna use another hyper potion, so. Haha! <laughs> we we actually did the final damage instead of the poison, yay! And Lorax grew to level 35. And we defeated Claire. I lost? I don't believe it. There must be some mistake. And we got money for winning, so that means we get the bad, right? No! I won't admit this. I may have lost, but you're still not ready for the Pokemon League. I know. You should take the Dragon User Challenge. Behind this gym is a place called Dragon's Den. Go and bring me the Dragon Fang from deep inside the den. That is the test to be accepted as a true dragon user. If you do that, I will accept you as a worthy trainer. So then, I won't give you a badge. This freaking At least with Whitney, she was willing to give you the badge after she was done crying. Freaking Why do people hate Whitney, but not Claire? She is just the worst in this game. Out of my way, kid. <laughs> <sighs> Gonna heal up our Pokemon and head straight to that friggin' cave. Bad. 
Welcome to Pokemon Center, blah, 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 blah. Shut up and take my Pokemon! I am angry! Alright, let's go to the friggin' cave. And after we go to the cave and do the thing, we can end the we can end the episode. And you know what? I don't care what Claire says. Boom! There's the badge on the trainer card at the bottom of the screen. Hello, friend. What do you have to say? Since Claire the Dragon Master has allowed it, you may yet to. Well, okay then. So basically, what we have to do here is find a specific item. What item is that? Well, I know, I've played this game before. <laughs> and of course, we're gonna need a Pokemon that knows Surf and Whirlpool to get through this. Also, you can find Magikarp here. Which, we're gonna be running away from all of them. Hey, there's, there's, there's Whirl Whirlpool. And there goes the Whirlpool. Okay, in Pokemon Crystal, instead of having to find a specific item, you had to go into this building. And in this building, you will be given a test. Depending on your answers, well, not only would you get the challenge done, but you would also get a rare Pokemon. That being a Dratini that knows extreme speed. And you can also do that in Heart Gold and Soul Silver to get that, too. Now, Dratini evolves into a really good. Oh, wait, there's Dragon Fang already. Anyway, it's a pretty easy way to get a Dragonite, and with one of its best moves. Where did you get here? Alright, I recognize your true power. We just surfed around and got rid of a Whirlpool. Be honest, you just wanted to calm down without having to see us. There's the Rising Badge. Give me my pin, I want to go to the League. When able, your Pokémon use the move for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokémon would recognize you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. I also want to have this TM. Okay, TM24, that is Dragon Breath. Unfortunately, I get the feeling none of our Pokémon can learn that. No, it doesn't have anything to do with my breath. <laughs> you don't want it, you don't have to take it. So you've collected all the badges. Your destination is the Pokemon League and the need to go plateau. Do you know how to get there? From here, go to New Bark Town, surf east. The route is there is very tough. Don't you dare lose the Pokemon League. If you do, I'll feel even worse without having lost to you. Okay, bye. And next time on Pokemon Gold, we will be in New Bark Town. Not only will we be in New Bark Town, but We'll find a magic carp apparently. We'll be in New Barktown, and we'll be on our way to the Pokemon League. And I'll officially say my ending thingamadoodle when we get out of this cave. I want to leave, please. Alright, Whirlpool. Let me out! I want to leave! I want to end the episode! Thank you! Come on, Magikarp! Everyone- oh! Oh! That's right! You can also find Dratini by doing this, but they won't have extreme speed. Also, do you know what level you have to get your Dragonair up to to evolve it into Dragonite? Fifty-five! The Tratini you get is level 30. Needless to say, yeah, you're gonna want to get that freaking. Oh, what? Hello, Alex? I have something here for you. Could you swing by my lab? See you later. Well then, next time on Pokemon Gold, we will swing by Professor Elm's lab and see what exactly he has for us for having defeated all eight of the Johto Gems. I will see you guys next time. See you in the next episode. Goodbye. Yes, I get there's already a save file. Let me save my game!